Good people, Uncle Hotep back at it again. How you doing, YouTube? Um, I gotta make a video about y'all might have read the story. There's two Maryland school, high school, two immigrants. <laughs> One is, is supposed to have been deported. I think one is supposed to have had his ICE status pending. But they went into high school. They, they enrolled, first of all, they enrolled in high school. One was 17, one was 18. They both enrolled as freshmen. How is an 18 year old enrolling as a freshman? How is a 17 year old enrolling as a freshman? That's the first, the first right off the bat. You know, people talking about vetting people and, and, and whatnot. You can't even, you don't even know what age these people are coming over. They went into high school. They rolled in high school. They they got this uh, girl, underage girl, and raped her, assaulted her in the bathroom. This is what you people, you white liberals, you, you black cucks, <laughs> well, are are saying should you know, just come on over because they, they need a better life. First of all, this guy's eighteen. How, how is an eighteen year old enrolling as a high school freshman? Like that's the thing, man. If people come from other country, no documentation, nothing. You can't prove how old they were. You don't. Know, you got no birth certificate or nothing like that. They just roll, make up anything and enroll in high school. I mean, come on, man. You gotta be. This is the thing about vetting. You rather not just not let anybody in because you're not gonna be able to properly vet anybody. This goes for the immigration ban. This goes for the, the, the wall on, on the southern border. You're not gonna be able to do it. Now, so this little girl is scarred for life because y'all let goddamn adults in as freshmen. If this guy was 17, I don't know when he's turning 18. He probably turned 18 soon. You know what I mean? What if he's turned 18 in like June? You're letting uh, <laughs> or, or May or whatever. You're letting these guys roll as freshmen in high school? Unbelievable, man. This really, really is unbelievable. Man. It's something really unbelievable. Y'all just <laughs> defend this the fuckery. Like, come on, people. Like, stop it. I, I don't even know what to say. Then, like, imagine how many other, like, this these people got caught because um, of the sexual assault. Their age got exposed. <laughs> now, imagine how many don't get caught that are in our high schools all across the country, and they enrolling is adults in the high school like <laughs> this boggles my mind man <laughs> this is incredible and like people don't see that immigration was the main reason the democrats lost this election and why they're going to continue to lose elections like 26 percent want a wall 13 percent want people deported as soon as possible that's nearly 40 percent see immigration as a primary issue as get either build a wall is to stop the immigration because you either you're stopping it with the wall and you're deporting you know what i'm saying you you, you have to have a border because they're just going to come right back over you need to talk about this catch and release dude they catch they're going to get the smuggler to bring them right back over if it's so easy for the smugglers to get over here. Unbelievable, man. How you letting eight I'm still stuck on the 18-year-old as a freshman. So he has stayed here been like 22 as a senior in high school? Man, come on, man. 21? Unbelievable, man. Like I can't even believe that that, that was uh people let that slide, man. And the charges they got, they're talking about triple life sentences. Anybody over the age of 16 is going to be charged as an adult for these crimes. Unbelievable. That's just, just 
disgusting. Bro. It really, really is, man. I don't, I don't even know how they. <laughs> Sad. Big sad. Anyway, it's all a hotel about peace.